To write the formula for oxygen dibromide, let's first look at what type of compound we have. So if we look at the periodic table divided into metals, nonmetals, and metalloids, we find oxygen, that's right here, and then we can find bromide, that's bromine, so that's going to be right here. So both of these are nonmetals. When we have two nonmetals, it's a molecular, also called a covalent compound. And we'll use these rules to write the formula. First, we want to write the element symbol for both elements. So oxygen, that's just O. And then bromide, that's from bromine, that's going to be BR. Next, we'll place a subscript after each element according to its prefix. For oxygen, since we only have one oxygen, we don't write mono because this is the first part of the name. So oxygen, since it doesn't say mono, doesn't have any other prefix, there's only one oxygen. By convention, we don't write that, though. It's assumed to be there. For bromide, this is bromine here, di, that means two. So we'll have two bromines. This makes the formula for oxygen dibromide OBR2. If you need help memorizing these prefixes like the di in oxygen dibromide, this table might be useful. This is Dr. B with the formula for oxygen dibromide. OBR2. Thanks for watching.